May is going to be a great month to get out and go stargazing, planet gazing, asteroid viewing, and much more. From close encounters between various planets and penumbral lunar eclipse to a whole spate of solar system viewing opportunities, there are plenty of May night sky events to mark on your calendar. Don't forget too that the Milky Way is rising for the Northern Hemisphere, so other nights are good too even if one of these events isn't happening. May 5th, Full Flower Moon May's full moon reaches its peak on May 5th, 2023. Here's everything you should know about this month's full moon, including how it came to be called the Flower Moon. When to see the full moon in May 2023. May's full flower moon reaches peak illumination at 1.36 p.m. EDT on Friday, May 5th. It will be below the horizon at this time, so plan to venture outdoors on the nights of the 4th and the 5th to get the best view of the bright full flower moon. Find a location with unobstructed views of the horizon, if possible. May 5th, Penumbral Lunar Eclipse On the night of May 5th a penumbral lunar eclipse will occur. During this penumbral eclipse, the moon passes deep into the outer part of Earth's shadow, known as the penumbra. The umbral magnitude of this eclipse is minus 0.046, which means the moon just misses the darker, inner part of Earth's shadow, which is called the umbra. By this measure, this is the deepest penumbral eclipse until September 2042. Penumbral lunar eclipses can be partial or full. During a partial penumbral eclipse, only part of the Earth's penumbra covers the moon's surface. This kind of eclipse is almost impossible to see. During a full penumbral eclipse, on the other hand, the Earth's penumbra covers the entire face of the moon. Very keen observers may then see the moon turn a shade darker during the maximum of the eclipse. May 6th, Peak of the Eta Aquarid Meteor Shower The Eta Aquarid Meteor Shower peaks on 5 to 6 May 2023. From the southern hemisphere, up to 50 meteors per hour are visible under ideal conditions. Eta Aquarid meteors are brief streaks of light emitted by plasma created as dust impacts the Earth's upper atmosphere at a speed of 65.6 km per second. The dust originates from Comet Halley. Meteorites always wow the crowds, and in May we have two decent chances for such celestial showers. The first one is the Eta Aquarid meteor shower, which peaks around May 6 this year. This is a better show for Earthlings near the equator since the constellation Aquarius, which serves as the meteor shower's radiant point, will be fairly low in the southern sky. You can catch this show between late April through most of May every year, but the peak will be around the 6th of May. The Eta Aquarius typically produce about 40 meteors per hour, not a bad way to kick off the month. Best of all, the moon will be a waning crescent, so unlikely to produce much interference. May 9th Comet C-2020 K1, Panstars, at Perihelion. Comet C-2020 K1, Panstars, will make its closest approach to the Sun on May 9th, at a distance of 3.07 astronomical units. On the day of Perihelion it will not be readily observable since it will lie so far south that it will never rise more than 10 degrees above the horizon. Comet C-2020 K1, Panstars, is currently in the constellation of industry. The current right ascension of Comet C-2020 K1, Panstars, I the current estimated magnitude of Comet is 13.11, JPL, while the latest observed magnitude is 13.0. May 17th Close Approach of Moon and Jupiter The Moon and Jupiter will make a close approach, passing within a mere 43.1 arc minutes of each other. From some parts of the world, the moon will pass in front of Jupiter, creating a lunar occultation. The moon will be 27 days old. The pair will be visible from soon after it rises, at 4.35, until soon before it sets at 17.09. Always take extreme caution when trying to make daytime observations of the moon while the sun is above the horizon. The moon will be at mag minus 9.4 in Aries and Jupiter will be at mag minus 2.1 in Pisces. 
Hope you will enjoy the May 2023 astronomy events. If you enjoyed watching the video, do give us a like, also share the same with astronomy lovers. And subscribe to our channel, Secrets of Space, for astronomy updates. Thank you for watching.